another passage. Beauty is... Fuck this. I can't do it. I can't do this to you. I'm not in the mood for a passage. Here I am in the mood for, though. There was once a guy that would say on accident, revealing his inner personal preferences, like he likes to smear mud on his ass, or he likes to hump the refrigerator, or he has dick cream, um, or he likes to fondle his sweaters. And every time he would say that, someone would say, what? What would you say? And then he would try to make act like he didn't actually say that. He was ashamed. But one day he couldn't, one day he couldn't, he couldn't get past this one individual. He said, hold on a minute. I don't care what you do in your private time. But don't lie about it. Be proud of who you are. Because I'm going to tell you something right here. I'm going to tell you something I never told anybody. I can suck my own dick. You heard that right. I can suck my own dick and I do it all the time. He said, there, I said it. I was honest. Because being honest, being true to yourself makes you feel better. So the next time he went and talked to somebody and accidentally, but not really accidentally, revealed his true intentions of what he wanted to do next. He stopped himself and said, you know what? No, I am going to hump through for Dreher because I am proud of who I am. That, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, is one of the most beautiful passages of all. It doesn't need to be poetry because the moral of the story is whether you like to hump a refrigerator, whether you like to suck your own dick, be true to yourself. Especially if it doesn't harm anybody else. Obviously. Be true to yourself, proud of who you are, and just embrace your free flag. Listen to us all.